Barbie is having a baby. We wonder if it's a boy or a girl. Find out in our new video. <laughs> and you'll see a ton of baby DIYs. Watch and do with Lalalu. Today is an important day for Barbie. She has to tell Jeffrey the news. Honey, are you all right? You look very focused on something. I have a surprise for you. Three of us now. <laughs> First off, let's change the shape of Barbie's belly. Take beige light clay. Mash it and shape a ball. Roll it out on a surface into a flat piece. Now we'll need a piece of textured sponge, foam rubber, or styrofoam. Cut a round piece from it. Put it onto the Barbie's belly and cover with the clay piece. Evenly press it to the surface. Remove the excess with a modeling tool. Smooth out the cracks and folds with a wet brush. Make a hole to be a belly button and put in a little ball. When light clay is dry, remove it and take out the base. Now the belly is light, comfy, and easy to take off. <laughs> well, it looks like Barbie will have to change her regular wardrobe for some time. On the other hand, she has a lot of nice fabric. Let's sew a dress for our pregnant doll from it. Barbie goes for pleated fabric. Nice choice! Measure the doll and pick out the length. Cut out a piece of the needed size. Gather it at the top with a stitch. Try it on. If it fits well, sew the side, and we can turn it right side out. Add a silver elastic ribbon at the top. Measure the circumference and glue the strip you got to the dress. We get a marvelous dress. Barbie looks fancy in it, and she still feels comfy. <laughs> Jeffrey has a bouquet of flowers. These are the last preparations. He already made a whole backdrop to meet his sweetheart. Balloons, flowers, columns, rhinestones. It looks so beautiful. Fill a balloon with confetti. Put the balloon onto a vial with glitter powder and put tiny glitter inside. Add big glitter. Blow the balloon and tie it. Wrap a wire around the tip so the balloon hovers as though there's helium inside. But still, is it a boy or a girl? We are about to find out. Yay! There's pink glitter everywhere around. We are having a girl. And finally, baby Susie is born. Mom and dad are in seventh heaven. Let's make a ring for bathing our baby. Trace something round on yellow foam paper. Stamp a glue cap closer to the inner edge. Cut out the details. Now cut a little strip of foam paper. Hot glue it around the little hole. Cut off the excess. What a nice ring. It looks good with the swimming suit. Let's make a bathtub from an empty shampoo bottle. Pick out the height and sketch out a wavy line. Carefully cut it out along the line with a utility knife. Take a little piece of white clay. Divide it in four identical parts and shape legs. Glue them to the corners of the bathtub so it stands still on a surface. We can paint the bathtub white to match the legs. And glue thick cord around the edge so the baby doesn't get hurt. Decorate the bathtub with cute baby stickers. Having a bath becomes a lot of fun with this design. No more tears. Bath time. Today our baby gladly takes a bubble bath. Barbie even puts on a ring and washes her hair without any trouble. Now the daughter is clean and mom is happy with the new bathtub. Let's make a rocking baby chair set so our baby falls asleep faster. We'll need a half of a kinder pack and a piece of sticker fabric. Attach the fabric to the kinder package. 
Cut off the excess and fold the edges inside. Fasten lace ribbon around the edge of the cot. Make legs from a wire so they're shaped like a rocking chair and make a hole for the cot. With this smooth rocking chair, baby will fall asleep faster than mom finishes a fairy tale. Trace a cardboard template on a cotton fabric with a baby pattern. Cut out two identical pieces and sew them along the contour. Turn it right side out. Stuff it with hollow fiber filling through the hole. When the blanket is soft, sew the hole shut. Add two more pieces with stuffing to the sides. Measure about two inches of cord. Cut it off and glue a smaller piece to the center. Now use hot glue to fasten the straps to the rocking chair. Done! Let's make a crib carousel from shining sequins so our baby isn't bored. Make a base from a wire. Attach sequins to silver threads and hang them onto hooks at the base. You can decorate it with a plastic rose on top. <laughs> Little Susie can stare at the sparkling circle for hours. They are so funny. And it's even better when you can swing at the same time. Let's make a soft envelope for a stroller. Trace a cardboard template on cotton fabric with a heart pattern. We need two details side by side. Cut them out along the common contour. Don't cut it in half. Sew the edges and leave a small hole. Stuff the envelope with hollow fiber filling through it. Turn it right side out. Stuff and sew it shut. Decorate with a tassel and add a snap fastener. Baby Susie likes walks outside. Mom and Dad love taking care of their daughter. They have to take turns to carry her. The important thing is that the baby won't freeze in this warm envelope. She can even take a nap outdoors. <laughs> Babies can't eat carefully yet, but there's no need to yell at them. It would be way better if you DIY'd a cute bib. Cut a piece with rounded corners from fabric with a cute pattern and another one of the same shape and size. Hot glue them to each other to make it double-sided. Attach decorative ribbon around the corner. Add a cord for tying and the bib is done. Mom is cooking lunch in the kitchen. Baby Susie is already hungry. Here comes the choo-choo train. Whoops, and here the bib comes in handy. Don't get upset, baby. You'll get big very soon, and I'll teach you to eat with a fork and a spoon. A baby car seat is next up. Add a few lines for bending on a long piece of cardboard so we can bend it into a car seat later. Coat one side with glue and add polyester fiber filling so it's softer. Wrap up fabric on two sides. And our seat is almost done. We add a few rounded details we made the same way and complete the car seat. Of course, we need to make a belt from ribbons. And add some decorations to taste. Now when you want to drive somewhere, the baby will not only be surrounded with beauty, but also safe. It's time to relax after a busy day and go on a family road trip in your car. Hit the thumbs up if you think playing with dolls will be much more fun with our DIYs. Don't forget to subscribe. <laughs> and if you click on the bell, you'll be the first ones to know about new videos on Lollaloo.